Hello, I'm Michael Hoting from Cloud Client Info and I would like to show you how you can configure the IT Universal Management Suite uh, to configure your SYN clients automatically. To do this, you first have to open the IT Universal Management Suite Administrator. This is a small tool which is only available on the management server, so you cannot open it through a web console. And here in other settings, you have the feature to enable the automatic registration. Automatic registration means each time a SYN client is booting up, the SYN client will automatically uh, accept it by the UMS. And this is very important to work with our automatic registration feature, configuration feature. So just confirm it would apply. Good. To get this also working, um, you have to set up in DHCP option 224 that points to the IP address or the DNS name of the management server. Important, if you work with the DHCP option, it must be a string text field. Or you can, as alternative, you can set up a DNS host entry. So the DNS host entry must be IGRM server that points to the IP address of the management server. If you have not done this, the SYN client will not automatically detect the client in the network infrastructure and will not be automatically registrated. So these two options are very important. Just refer to the UMS manual, which is available on the IGR website. Okay, after you have done this, move to the UMS console. In the UMS console, you will do the main SYN client configuration. I have already set up here a small environment, so I have set up a small profile, which is a configuration for a SYN client. It's a very simple profile, only with a few basic configuration settings. And in SYN client, I have set up a My Company folder. And I want that all new clients or existing clients uh, contact or will be uh, moved automatically to the My Company folder and will pick up the configuration assigned to the My Company folder. As you see here, in Assigned Objects, I have already assigned this base configuration to the My Company folder. You can just do it through drag and drop, it's quite simple. Okay, now I need to set up a default directory rule. To do this, click on MISC and then Default Directories. Here you can create rules how the UMS will move, assign clients to these configuration directories. So when I click on Add, I can now select the folder which belongs to the SYN client directory and I select the My Company folder here. You can also say in what cases should these rules apply. So what does it do it mean? If this option overrides existing directory membership is enabled, the rule will be applied for all SYN clients already existing clients and new SYN clients. If this rule is disabled, only new clients will be moved to the My Company folder. So in my case, I want that all clients uh, will be handled by this rule, so I enable it. You can also configure here, should the rule be applied when the SYN client is booting? Yes, I want to do this. And also important here, leave in subdirectory. Leave in subdirectory is important if you work with subdirectories in my company. This could be necessary if you want to assign different configurations uh, like MISC resolutions, MISC USB configurations, whatever, to the SYN clients. So it may happen that you move a SYN client from the my company folder to a subdirectory and if this option is not enabled, the UMS will always move the client back to the my company folder. So it's very important if you deal with subdirectories here, just enable the subdirectory sub option. Good, I confirm this with next. Now I'm asked what criteria should be used or what criteria should be used to assign the SYN client to this folder. In my case, I use last known IP address, but you can also use other fields like name, network name, product name, product ID, firmware version and net mask. I want to use the IP address and next. And now I will enter the IP range which is assigned to the clients in my network infrastructure. So, and next and finish. So, after I have created the rule, I only have to save it. And now I can switch on my SYN client. I will do this. Um, 
until the thin client is booting, you can also move uh, or change this directory rules at any time. So when you click on default directories again, you select one of your default directory rules, click on modify, then you can change the folders where the rule belongs to. Um, you can also add more criteria as AND and ALL criteria, so we can build up really complex uh, rules here if necessary. Okay, my SYN client is putting up. It's nearly finished. I will click on cancel here. So now I need to press F5 and as you see after the refresh the SYN client is now directly popping up into the My Company folder. I have done nothing special. Uh, all other SYN clients in the network infrastructure will no, now directly come up uh, into this My Company folder and will automatically get a configuration. So I have nothing more to do. It's quite simple, quite easy and quite useful. Okay, I hope this has explains a little bit how you can set up an automatic configuration with the UMS. Thank you for your attention and have a nice day. Bye.